Hey folks, welcome back to Ostrov. I'm looking at our town from the point of view of brand new carts that are just entering the map. So they come in, they see this, and then they get lost. Oh, oh that's right, I gotta be up here. <laughs> and they see our plows and wander through trying to find that trader, bump into a log. Uh huh. Right on through into the trader. Of course, it looks cold and desolate right now, dead of winter. It does. Right up to the tavern. Yep. <laughs> so how's occupancy in here? A couple more there. And then two rows back in here. Okay. Just keep an eye on that once in a while. I pulled the carrots and cabbage out. Out of the trader though I don't I can't really grab these guys but we're not gonna put any more in and I say trader pigsty um, so we'll just deal with potatoes primarily potatoes with a backup of wheat but and the what was the other thing beetroots so we'll use up our beetroots over here too but I think potatoes are gonna be their main uh, uh, food from here on out I went through and and uh, placed a few bushes here and there and slowly starting to to build up plantings through the place but I guess we'll have to wait for spring to make that look good there's our traders going back through the snow laden not apparently not fully frozen river trying to get home in time it's got to be a worrisome trip let's speed this up cows we're at 8 out of 20 Okay, um, so our rotation is correct now. Yeah, one, two, three, four. All right, and between episodes, I went through this farm over here. All right there, so these six fields, and I found a rotation online rather than sit here and scratch my head and do the, uh, do the math. But this right here will rotate us through. I could vary this a bit. I probably should think about that. Go in as we're, uh, you know, before we get too deep into this, there's other combinations of this. One of them being wheat. Uh, I'm trying to think what else jumps into there, but different combinations that will make that work. Give me six fields with a rotation of six fallows. You know, throughout the uh, throughout the years, so that will satisfy the need for the cows up in here, and I'll maintain these the way they were, leaving a, an extra fallow field once in a while, just just because I don't want to go through and redo it all. But uh, what we have is functioning. We're just crossing through into January of 1752, so 30. We've been running this for 30 years. Wow. What are you up to? Supplying resources and working. But we're not rotating. Why is that? Working means you're just sitting there. Oh, the wheat hasn't arrived. That's why. Okay. So you are on your way. Doing what? What is that? It's on your shoulder. Ah, there we go. Got some wheat to grind. If you toss that in there, you just loaded it up. Taking a rest and taking a rest. Dudes, I just wanted to see it start. <laughs> yeah, such is life in Ostrov. Anyway, what do we got going on? We're going to pretty much just start working through some of this list today. Try to keep the speed up. You are Balaklia, so that was last episode. I had them start a third hops field. So we'll go ahead and get three of these guys up and running. Though at this point we would be limited to barley. There is that. Hmm. Let's stare at something here for let's slow it. I well, don't really need to. I've got till March. Um, let's just pick you. So wheat, buckwheat, barley. Can we improve upon that? Um, let's grab the wheat. So wheat, 50, 60, buckwheat, we drop off the red and only use 20 and use a lot of blue 
and then barley we go back to the red and the green but throughout all of this we're adding 15 percent in between for for uh, plowing how do we get actually 50 50 and 50 60 so we could substitute a barley anywhere we want for a wheat let's do that let's make you barley so barley barley wheat buck wheat barley over here now that's all four yeah that was a rotation of all four let's do two fields that do in fact let's do this one because we're going to be short on that one so if we can switch you over to barley now we'll at least have a little bit extra blue available but i'm not sure that's what i'm going to be missing but yeah so we've our blue or, or green green that might work we'll see that gives us yeah that gives us some extra barley to offset this extra hops should we go even further what was that noise that noise was the hops farm right yeah let's go even further let's let's see wheat 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 come on stop making noises so i can think we've got one wheat out of here every year we have no wheat out of here anymore we used to have some in there before there's no wheat out of here right there so yeah let's leave two fields producing wheat every four years the rest will be barleys yeah that'll give us a little more in there though i can buy wheat easy enough child has been born but we'll, we'll let that one run and see how that goes you did come over and fill it up i was hoping i'm gonna watch you fill it up and then shift the uh, the windmill over that was my plan visiting a tavern supplying resources and the blue bar is full so he's done working once he gets back with some extra <clears throat> and you see what it was probably wheat then he's off to go home you guys buying food turning a windmill by hand ah i was on the wrong side of the camera to see it anyway let's go and reset this guy we'll set everything to this rotation so still have some hops unused over here waiting for the new season and no sense of a of a rot on it so that's good to see you're hauling most of that or about 50 of that out um okay child has been born i want to transfer all of these settings so four in each one just for march august september yeah that works all right, so we get those going. We still have some hay out on the dryers. A lot over here, too. So it's just a matter of getting someone out here to either move it or, in a sense, this is all one great big hay barracks, too. It's just sitting out here instead of in there. So as far as the game goes, it works. Real life, all that snow on there melting and thawing and, and soaking it. And I would imagine we'd get some some mildew or mold in there eventually but it works for Ostrov. so how are we doing here we've got everything up and running again in this one and wagon needs repair over here and that theoretically would be you repairing a cart repairing a cart you going to work and taking a rest I restarted this forestry up here with just one guy. The idea that he won't be able to do... You're kidding. He's going to sit there and wait for a partner. I was hoping he would just wander around and plant trees. But apparently that's not a thing. <laughs> well, alright, we'll give him a partner and just see what happens. But yeah, that's a shame. I was hoping he could just wander around and plant trees all over the map and and uh, make it happen but i wonder if trees are planted by a forestry that that is assigned to them like the forestry that is assigned to be taking the trees down for this construction site i wonder if tree planting works in the same way and one particular forestry is in charge of that and it isn't this one I don't know. You're you guys are not going to sync up for a long time. Taking a rest and going to work. So let's just cancel that idea. That is not going to work. I'm just going to have two guys taken out of the labor force, accomplishing nothing. Okay, I've been hearing a lot of noises, gazebos. So what do we think of? Does that look like playground equipment to you? It does to me. 
you know, from here at Jungle Gym or something, but there's 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 a bigger, more complex uh, structure right there, all combined into each other. <laughs> oh, what does the one over here look like? Was it this one? Yeah. So I stuck these in the corner. We'll get some bushes around them and see how that looks. In fact, let's go ahead and do that now. Is that fence going to stay? I see they've been taking some of these down. Then I put the red X's back out so they went back to work uh, doing their assignments. Let's, let's see. Trees go in last. I want to get bushes in first. Otherwise, you can't place the bushes near the trees. So lilac. And we'll put you guys there as kind of an entrance. Yeah, we'll do both. There and there. And there and there. So there's our burst of color. Let's also do it there and there. All right. Now, normally you wouldn't put roses. These are both roses in a schoolyard. That's just asking for kids to get hurt. But for us, it's just going to be color. So there. And let's put three in the corner. Like so. Um, let's do all the corners with three. Big clump. Then let's see about putting in a birch into each of those clumps. Too close to another tree. Great. Okay. You're going there. I guess you're just going to have to be offset. We just won't. Uh, we just won't look that close. Yeah. Otherwise, let's get the white shrubs in front. In front here. Yeah, it's like so. Okay, and I guess we'll finish out in here. Um, yeah, I won't put another tree in there just in case that uh, causes a conflict with being able to plant this up again. Hmm. So when they cut all these out, I wonder if I might be too late now to have put that tree in then. Would they not be able to replant in here? Don't know. That, that limitation of how close they can be together is kind of annoying. Like this. About as close as I can get these guys together without it uh, throwing up a, a red message telling me no. Would be nice to create. Let's see, how close do they get naturally? I'm trying to find two of them that are right next to each other, and I guess they aren't. Although these seem a little bit closer than I can get to planting my own, right? Let's just try that. Those are spruce. Yeah, I've got to go out as far as there. I can't get that close. Okay. Balaclia over here. I need someone who buys apples. Stop sending me the same one over and over. Um, Lime nails. Nails were in that 17 range. Okay. 17,000 in the treasury. And potatoes enough for us till we get probably closer to August. Then we'll sell off the the old sallow we were in the fours now we're in the nines so we are finally making some serious sallow good um sallow is stored where right there do we move our storage over hmm i wonder how to do that well i guess i've got everything pretty much triggered in here already so i don't have to go and chase categories anymore and you are not going to be a gather from others so but wheat and barley do we do that here we don't we just I guess we just leave it in there because I want the wheat to be able to store up in here as well you are I take from other granaries uh, okay so you are going to be heading there and so I don't think I can do that to this one Okay, I'm looking for a granary that I can click this. I guess it's this one. Is there anything else? There's not. Okay, so you're just going to sit vacant for a while. We've got March coming and planting's about to happen. Kind of 
pause here for a moment. So any other changes to plantings? I think we're good. I can't change them once they start. But I think we're fine. There we go. March. And what was I doing? Thinking about this. Do we start drawing everything in from here to here? I think we're going to give that a try. Let's go ahead and make that happen. So you're planted up. You're take from. You're take from. You are no longer take from. All right, and we'll start shifting everything over you. Okay, so all the meats. How do we deal with that? And which ones do we leave here because of the of the trader? Probably the apples stay in this area. For for example, the salt probably does too. Hmm. I'll have to think about that one. But I guess a lot of these sort of things that need to be done manually will go into this last one. So we can say take from. Or you just... Then we could do that. We could set the barley and wheat in here with the booze. Which is kind of what it's for anyway. And then you can be meats and everything else. Yeah. So I'm already not used to using this one. So I think I'd rather do that one there. Let's do that. Wheat and barley. Uh, nothing else needed for you. And nothing I need to check. Well, that curiosity. Uh, I think everything is... Well, this one must... be yeah, it went fallow. Okay. Um, everything's being plowed. So where am I? There. You're starting to get folks in. You are too. And this one. There. We just hit the first plowed field. Okay. So, check back in here in a moment. And corner row house is being worked on. Okay. So, wheat and barley. Uh, barley. There you are. And wheat. Right down there. And we'll put 5,000 in each. Okay. That's done. You are no longer... And I'll go through and set up. In fact, let's just toss you out for now. So you need a worker now. and But you don't need much. Let's set up two workers. Let's let them go out and get from the farms. So we'll do that. You four are going to be grabbing all of the main stuff. And I don't see anything actually being gathered. Going to work, taking a rest child has been born we're in the 428 range wow i didn't realize we crossed through 400 so population is starting to expand at a faster rate with so many potential children being born all the time um just looking at this right now and thinking about children still only four over here uh this one one so many potential children. All right, this community knows what they're doing. There's eight in there. And what is our island doing? You've got six. Okay, that's good. Tavern, 40, made 120. Came in with 140, down to 108. I guess you bought a lot. You bought a lot of booze. Month's income, 61. Wow. Ah, uh, luckily, <laughs> Okay, and 21 income over here. Now, only one worker. That probably has something to do with the uh, the amount that can be served. Maybe so. Like the number of cow shed workers versus the amount of milk coming in. But luckily, you are, am I correct, the same one we just had? Yeah, right there. So nothing has changed. Going to ignore all of you? I think so. Yep. So maybe we'll get Dirkachi. Uh, Dirkachi buys our charcoal. Charcoal is only at 8,000. So that's not happening quite as fast. Though, we are, once we finish the planting, this is usually the time that we go through and fill up all of the charcoal. So how are we here? Growth, 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 and sowing. So one field left. Uh, here, sowing, growth sewing so not as fast got a good group of people in here though but we've only done the one field and we're just finishing this guy and moving into this one cows are out there in the fallow field 
and we've got our birch trees planted over here so yeah no change there these were already planted right I think they were when I was over here looking at this I think I noticed that they were it's over here that need now somebody got into these too that needs to be done all right so you guys <clears throat> growth sowing just two fields this year and we still haven't got it done <laughs> and over here how do we deal growth growth and growth the so sowing is all finished here and so that should move a lot more people over into this one we have a whole field to do right no we're finished okay that's done so this is the last farm and right over there and we're halfway through it okay so that means we could move into charcoal if we wished you guys are we just can't keep up with it okay woods at zero so we're just concentrating on bark and firewood and anybody assigned to fill these guys up uh one over here are we emptying we're not charcoal and storage is zero we store charcoal up uh, here, here, zero. I don't think I put any into this one. I did, another 5,000 in there, okay. And is there still 5,000 down here? Yes, 8,000. So there's where the charcoal's sitting right now. That one, when we had you know, plenty in the system, we can fill this up and it's easy to put right back into the uh, that's right. One time I was going to try to move this over a little bit and give us a better pathway for carts to move up into here. Never did get back to that. Not truly needed. I think the game will squeeze them through anyway, but thought, I will say I've never seen one of these try. Huh. For them to deliver from here to here, I guess they've got to go around. It's not that far. It's not. <laughs> Alright, so you guys are not hired yet i took another month off okay but all the plantings are done and i want to see a bunch of charcoal being made looking for gatherers in queue you are full of wood okay so we need to get wood transported over let's see what are we working on working on the row house right there wood in this area is here and we could let's do that i want to watch that row house build but let's quickly send a wagon of wood can't you say a wagon of all right let's just say seven thousand then wood two here right one yeah all right you're going in roof is about finished And we're done in slow motion. All right, so pause, have married, moving in. I want to relocate you guys to here. And then I want to demolish. No, <laughs> I want to. That not work? Wait a minute here. I didn't see their names. Did not work. Try that again. You propose relocation to here. No message. Not giving me a message. So, though it says that you can, apparently you cannot. Interesting. I guess that means you have to relocate them to another tavern. Huh. Let it run. No changes. Okay. Well, <clears throat> I guess that is a thing. Now, if I just hit demolish, do that. Need to re relocate the family first. <laughs> All right. One more try. Now, it's not because I'm doing anything wrong at this end. These are definitely vacant. Okay. Propose. Relocate. Vacant house to relocate. Yep. And it's not a right click or anything like that. No. Nope. 
apparently this doesn't count as a normal family. It counts as a profession or something. And yeah, they are permanently and forever tavern owners. Okay. <clears throat> well, then how do we make this little tavern work better? It's an idea. What if we built just a tiny little community right over here? Let's let this run slow for a bit. Um, let's check on Hopso. So... I don't know what happened here. Or it didn't happen. No workers. Did nobody ever hire over here? Growth growth oh okay pop you back in apparently they didn't finish but it looks like these did plant when we planted last time we didn't see okay no, I guess I can see it right there tiny tiny little green no green at all it's like this one never hired there's no green maybe it won't green until it hits 100 percent and then it triggers it possible all right we'll go apparently i need to go two months on these guys off season two i oh because i just put two in okay let's put four back into this thing you um Okay, right there and there. Let's do that. I just have to remember to come back and take them out. But four of them gives me a little bit better chance of somebody making it over here and finishing it. Apparently, I'm guessing they got to like 90% and then we ran out of March. Okay, well, um, what was I in the middle of? I was playing with an idea over here. And I guess that's just probably going to be a fail this year, that, that one. Um, what if we put another row house or two in here into... Hmm, move this guy again and put a little community right here? I didn't want... I, I kind of vetoed my idea of putting them up in here because they're so far away from work. But over here, though we have plenty of population, they at least have a better chance of finding something to do. Now, the corner row house was meant to be, you know, a corner of a big square with a nice courtyard in the middle. We never really built that or got to see that because the idea came up early to run these carriage pass-throughs with the bridges. And I thought that was a great idea, but it eliminated the ability to do much here unless I took one of these buildings and squished it down and made a little tiny square in here between two corners. And I just didn't like that idea. So, yeah. So we couldn't do it there. That came out looking pretty good. There's our two ends. And there'll be trees growing up these ends when it's all done. And I did put lots of plantings in and around here. There should be lots of colors. I got all three of the uh, colored bushes in there. And all the trees are blossoming out. And this is going to be nice and full over here with a pathway down to the water. Yeah, it's going to look good. But over in here, I can see this kind of working. And it would get this guy up and running again permanently. And it would satisfy other things like needing to get workers out to the little more extremes. And it would give us the option to do something else in this area if we choose to. So let's think about that. And there's really no rules here. There's nothing planned for this area. The only exception is, is what to do with this guy. So this guy out front, pathway going in is where? Right here? I'm thinking a two-story. All these will be two stories. Two-story arch to pass through corner let's see here um, let's parallel with these guys let's 
something like that. That's pretty consistent. What am I seeing here? Trees. Touch more. That's looking good all the way through there. So we'll base it off of this. Pass through and I guess big staircase to the outside. So we're going to need this and then a corner and then a corner. So getting that pass through off to a side is going to be a little more difficult unless we're down here. Okay, so that means um, it's on this side. So right there. Let's just lay one out and see what happens. So you're going to drop into there. And then we want a corner, two-story. And you head into here. Flip you around like so. Now these are not the same width as those. I never know exactly what that means. How do these line up over here? Right there. So in order to make it look good in here, the yellows have to align with each other. That leaves a void in the back that's not going to align well. But that's the back of the building, so you don't see it anyway. Okay. So yellow needs to align in the front. Right there. And then I guess a I guess we're going for a square. One inlet only? Yeah, I think so. Yeah. So two story. With stores. Yeah. So you're here. And we exit out the back. Oh, interesting. Well, it's hard to see through the... That needs to be there. The corners. Okay, so you go away. And what else is happening while we're doing all this? Because we may be uh, a while. So we're building houses. I'm going to go ahead and run it at a slower speed. So one, two, three, four, five houses. We're still taking trees down on these. You are a small granary. I can kick you up and get that one built. You are... Another hops in queue. That's that one right there. Let's cancel that one for now. That goes away. That is another gazebo. Let's move you up into there. And that is it. Okay. So take the corners out. Put them in last. Now I kind of see how that works. So there. There. Now do it this way. Oh, I didn't put it in. Okay, so these corners right here, I think I need to line up first. And then the, the corner house will just tuck in, but it's that little diagonal spot. I think that is the key right there. Literally, the key. Um, <clears throat> Two-story was store. And hold the shift, because that one... I think it's going to be the center of all of these. So, F. And, yeah, big staircase out. You drop in like so. Got that right? I think I do. You guys should line up really close. Space is occupied. What am I hitting? There, there. Oh, this diagonal right here is off because of that, that line in it. That's so it doesn't look like I'm actually there. Okay. So you are there and there. I say that's it. Now, four corners. That gives me one, two, three stores. I don't think the pass-through has... No, you, don't, you guys don't have stores. You're just apartments. Yeah. Did you feel? We still have one vacant apartment. Pause. Is there anybody for any reason that we want to evict? I can't remember anything else coming up. Gave up on the idea of the mayor's mansion. That just didn't really work out. Um, but we did get the priest living here. That worked out well. And he's only 31, so he's going to be here a while. Um, I don't think there was any other house that was in a bad spot that I really wanted to get rid of. 
No, I think we're good there. All right, so let those build, and that other corner will fill when it fills. So corner houses, corners have stores in them? Remind me, they do not. That's right. Right there, they do not either. So it's just the three that are going to have the stores over here. And corner, two floor. Yeah. So you will drop into here. That about as close as I can get. Oh, that one pixel. Let me try something. Hit my DPI switch. It doesn't work. Interesting. The game's not allowing it to change anything. I wonder if that's something that actually has to be programmed into the code to work. Huh. Um. Oops. Darn it, that's the worst thing I could have done. Okay, I realign. But I've got to switch on my mouse to change the DPI setting right there. Okay, so F is what I wanted. So that I could move it very, you know, very slowly. Okay, as good as I'm going to get there. But it, the game won't let me use it. Interesting. I didn't know that was game dependent. You're there, and just aligning that one little corner. Oh, another pixel. Okay, so those guys are there, and that will be interesting to watch it build. It will. So we're going to need this full crew over here, and i kind of like to get that going sooner than later. So let's do that. Let's move you into there. We got the the small granary one tree out. Let's move these guys in by order of number of trees to take down. And let's just get this built. Three. There's a couple of fours. More ambitious of a project than I had planned on doing. But I would kind of like to see it too. Otherwise, we are, Dracachi, we are building the houses in this area. And so they've got a lot of these trees moved out. Dracachi, what does that mean? Not a lot of charcoal made it through. So it looks like we mostly just have charcoal for ourselves right now. Charcoal, 2,400. Yeah, not selling anything to Dracachi charcoal-wise. Do you buy apples? You do. Great. So, how many? We got the 4,000 sitting here. 3486 sitting here. That's a strange number. And they're out of... Okay, we're out of the system. So let's take you down to 2,000. And let's sell that. So, world map. Apples. Let's sell 2,000 to you. And deal. And that should leave available uh, 1486. Does that show up in here now? It does not. So I'll need to get it out of the, uh, the line item here. Once that does, then they'll be sitting here available to grab again. But if apples are all gone, uh, there were some sitting out here at one time. Yeah, they've been moving them around. They've been selling them. Interesting. Okay. Um, right there. Let's go through this. You're offering to sell to us leather. Yes, 2,000 leather, please. And deal. We're at 17,000 up there. Metal parts, we're in the 300 still. That's where we tend to, to hover. 2,000 in iron. I could sell some of that. Don't want any animals. Sallow, we could be selling now. Dried fish, we could be selling. Potatoes, we're at... May, June, July, August. We're, we're in a good shape there. What's the condition of our potatoes? Did anything move over here? From the other places. That's quite a bit of quantity here. Okay. Potatoes aren't a thing, though, over here yet. They would have been in this one. All these need to be transferred. I'll do that in between uh, episodes. And there's actually more products than we had room for in this one. I was throwing some out. There's apples. So it makes sense that we will be hiring up both of these to do the job of this guy. 
there's still quite a few products that I don't think uh, pork is in the system anywhere over here for example which might be why it's not selling and not why we're, we're rotting away so much of it because it's only sitting over here so maybe these folks never get around to getting it store pork you no you yeah pork is over here but it's not here yeah so if it was sitting over here it might be in here a lot more often okay so there's a little fine tuning i need to do but that's a lot of just staring at the screen and mumbling to myself so i'll do that after the episode's over but yeah this setup over here that's going to be kind of interesting i've wanted to build one of those and seems like a few years ago i fired up the game and did something like that just for myself i kind of or maybe i'm thinking of banished colonial charter they had the corner buildings that's that's probably what i'm thinking of so i think i did it there but yeah i did so i have not done that in ostrov okay you are changing colors your buckwheat barley barley okay lots of barley coming in now did the hops ever get moved out of here it did okay hops was to be stored beer right there um yeah none of it is stored you beer are over here and just kind of waiting so we need to meter you down seasonal hiring and you're going to get going pretty heavy in oh a lot of harvesting happening in here i can see you being Okay, um, like that, take the rest of the year off and see if there's enough product to get through there. Could be, <clears throat> but that means there's beer there and it's reserved. Beer has been moving into the system. Beer, 120. Village house is completed. They've married and moved. That means this must be full now. Yeah, so beer is a thing okay we got beer in you we've got beer over here and we've got beer over here all right and over here yes 220 so those two batches we got through there were enough to put beer in all the taverns and have some sitting in both the warehouses so that worked out quite well good it's working. Rolka, we've calmed you down. There's 3,300 sitting here. We have to calm you down a lot more. All right, same sort of thing. You come out as wheat. So... We'll do the same five months. And we took you down to two batches. Any... Th three batches of 500. And there will be... Three workers, two batches of 500, and there'll be three. We could take you down to two workers for that. I think so. There, actually, pause. There are batches running. Oh, never mind. Get you going again just to finish these batches out. And then we'll take you down to zero batches so we don't... Uh, there we go. Distilling. I uh, need two workers minimum. Okay. So we'll let these finish off. And then bring it back up again and get it started although I don't know how that works do we lose a batch if we don't have workers obviously they stopped processing but will we ruin them like we will tanning meaning is can there be an off season I don't know that's just wheat and water we're always going to have enough to get that next batch going so maybe over here we are doing something like one and we're all year round. So we don't have batches not, uh, you know, batches dying on us if that is a thing. Or we take our numbers down considerably. We could do something more like that. Oh, that one pixel. Yeah, we're making it much faster than we can deal with it. Pause to you guys. I've never even looked. You guys do buy. Oh, you do. All right, let's do that then. 
All right, we'll make this a we'll make this an industry. All right, so deal twenty fifty eight, and I guess we could store some of that over here, though. There have been times when I've used every line item in this place. Yeah. Um, Hiroka, let's... What, what's my timing? Seven days. Okay, turn back on. And you... Yeah, I already did this, the sale. I just need to get it in stock. Right there. And I've lost the number. 2058. Alright, so we will sell you... Temporary you... Let's not. Do we have enough in the system? Not really. That will bankrupt the town unless I just keep this going. Wheat in the system is looking like what? 600. Yeah. Okay. So you are temporary. I can't stock you. And we will still meter this down. Although we can go to 500. But one batch and two guys to run it. Okay. We'll do that. Yeah. Now, you, though, we're just flat out going to run out of supplies. So we'll have to see how that works, unless I slow this down, too. Two batches per for more months. That will stretch things out. Could start in September at that point. Okay. We'll see how that works. Um, where am I at? 50-ish minutes? Okay. So, you're set up to run. Speed things up again. Need lots of brick, which means I'm going to need more lime and all those other things too. Lime. Stones. Yeah, there's 8,000 stones sitting here. Do you guys sell lime? You do. Let's bring in 2,500 more deal. And iron, there's nothing else that I need in regard to those kind of building supplies. No, we're good. Now, we are going to have enough potatoes to get through. 700 potatoes left, June, July, August. It sure seems like we'd have enough. You guys are doing what right now? There's still 500 over here. Yeah, let's not buy any more. Let's use up until we run out of the old potatoes. Let the pigs eat them all. Okay, 20 out of 20... So sallow, we could we could stand selling. So we need to get a Marifa. Or I don't think Balaklia bought it. Doesn't seem right. And I need some more cherry trees. So this distance here, gazebo's done. Looks pretty good to that distance there. Do we do the arch? I kind of think we do. This is looking really good with all of the uh, the lilacs and the uh, the dog rose. Yeah, could use probably a little more right in here, but... And then I need to stone this in. Let's... Can I stone that in? I actually don't know that I can. Um, broken a hand. May. I don't think it's anything I need to be worrying about here. Though we could start peppering these guys in. Let's do something like that. So that we have time to build and make bricks in between. Yeah, I'm kind of liking that idea. Let's build them that way. Um, stone, paving, pavement. We can. It will let me. Okay. What do I do here? Kind of just stuck to the path. I didn't go the width of the arch. Okay. So let's... There. Oh. Okay, yeah, yeah, that does work. Though we don't really line things up properly here. We'll do that. And that. Okay. And you can move in here real quick too, right after that. Then let's do that again here. I need to go through and kind of clean all this up too. So we're going pretty much from column to column. So there. Ah, uh, I don't think it's going to let me now. Unfortunately, they, they don't talk to each other. Okay, so we're just doing this at this point. Okay. I know there's talk in the updates and hotfixes about improving the way the paving system works. And this is still just a work in progress, this entire game. 
There's a lot more game to come. So things are being tried out, experimented with, changed, improved, or eliminated. And that's just how games build. All right, so in that case, nothing else is you is right there. Nothing else is truly needing my attention right now. We're just bringing materials over. So where do we end up in regard to that clay pit? Before I go over there and play with that some more. You do need to leave. But we need clay. We don't need clay. So you would be nice to be near the brickworks here. We could do that. We could just stick it right back in here and make it uh, temporarily. We can put it right here. It kind of fits the the look of the industrial yard. What's I don't want it near that corner of the building right there. Over here, I think we did that once. We tried that and it didn't work. There are no doors out over here, but still, unless I were to get you this way. You just don't fit. Okay. Over here, you're too close to the building as well. Okay. So, Clay, we need to come up with a new place for that so you're not next to this new building. But do you... You are me that we're bringing in. Okay. Do you buy anything that we're trying to get rid of? Do you buy... You buy beer. We don't have enough yet, but you are a place to get rid of it. Okay, good. Um, apples, 446. Did this happen? It did. So you are back into the system again. You're no longer a line item. And you're being fed back in. We still have half a life on these guys. Okay, so we'll leave apples alone. But they're available again. Lime to purchase. Uh, you want to sell to us. Our salt, we're back in the sixes. Good. Window glass, we're making our own. We're maintaining. Dried fish, we are in the 1100s. What's our honey looking like? We're in the 1200s. Okay, that is all looking good. Sunflower oil, 2000. Let's move 1000 of that into the system to start paying for some of the, uh, the building materials we're buying. So sunflower oil, 1000. And temporary U flower, 1,000. It does expire, so we got to keep moving that through. Deal, flower. Clothes, we can only sell five things. Sallow needs to be in that list. Let's sell off 600 sallow. There you are. All right. What's the next most important things? Beer lime. So looks like it comes down to these two. Clothes and warm clothes. So we could sell off 1,000 of each of those. Kind of deplete our stocks a little bit. Uh, warm clothes and clothes. Yeah. But I think we can replace that fast enough so clothes and warm clothes of 1000 each okay with that we have very few laborers this is coming by boat we shouldn't have a problem with making that happen okay and you still don't show me that any boats are on their way you do. I, has that always been there? I don't remember seeing the boats going across before. Hmm. Okay, well, you're definitely on your way. Um, sunflower oil, we did a thousand of everything except for the sallow. So 300 sallows on its way. Flour is not doing too much there. 600 of this is on its way. Okay, so that's probably a whole uh, wagon's worth. All right. You are what? You're here to buy our Horelka. Okay. Um, am I there? I'm about there. I feel like I was in the middle of something we were discussing. So that's being worked on. Um, paving. Okay. So we're paving there, there, there. 
do I paper? Oh, this is what I was working on. Okay, so after this episode, I'll set an arch in here, reset the fences, stare at this a little bit. I can't put an arch in there. I don't want to rebuild the bridge in order to make it work. But I could put... Get this road reestablished. Well, no, it just came out the front. Yeah. So we were going to open up a roadway here and open up a roadway here. And that was going to finish the, the symmetry of the arches on this side. But the road doesn't go through. So there's no point in doing that here or here. It's not a pattern to duplicate. So I guess just one nice arch, probably in this area, right in front of the barber surgeon, and then take the fence in and find a way to kind of join them together. I guess just leaving a gap like this for traffic, and that will finish this area. So I'll do a lot of that after the episode and kind of clean that up and get some more trees planted. And... I guess that's about it for this episode. Yep. Yeah. All right, folks, I'll catch you next time. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye now.